Good morning everybody and welcome to day 28 of lockdown. Hang on a minute, that doesn't seem right. Good morning. Yeah, I thought I'd do it a bit different today. I've always done the uh, lockdown videos, film most of it in the evening, setting the camera. Well today, I'm gonna take you to collect the camera. Um, I feel like I'm half asleep. I suppose I probably am. It's about quarter past six. Just got up, straight out. It's a lovely morning, lovely and sunny. Cool, quite cool, but still very nice. Sun's just coming up behind me. Naturally, there's nobody about. Um, there's a guy with a dog who usually comes out about half six. So I need to get to the camera, get that collected. Unless somebody's been out earlier. And uh, see if we've got any footage from last night. So I'm still still be going out for my walk later tonight so uh, there might be some footage from uh, this evening's walk on the video these rams and flowers are really starting to open up now are these these ones here that I haven't told them yet they're not quite as harsh as the leaves for taste really nice compared to the leaves the leaves are really quite tart but the flower heads it's just like onion just like spring onion mm, really nice I made sure I picked one further in though so the dogs don't uh, you know no sooner had I finished that clip I looked to my right and there's a dog and then obviously just behind that was his own. And you probably saw everything I just did then. And he had wellies on. And I reckon he's just come through the field. So he's probably seen the camera. And his dog might have, might have eaten the bait. I thought I was the only one out at this time. Seemingly not. Right, into the field now. There's the... Uh, Crab apple blossom, I think that's probably going to be. Got the bugle down there. That purple flower. And there's loads more of that over here. A lot of dew on the ground this morning. There you go, there's loads of bugle there. It all, all depends on which way that guy's come with his dog. There's this path here that goes off and round and through that gap, and you can go right around the back of the hedge, come out to the other side, and then walk around that way. Or you can cut through the middle, which is where we're going to go to collect the camera. But that guy was wondering what I was doing, talking to myself with my camera. Scratch mark that I spotted yesterday morning. Don't know what it's from. I can see the camera it's still there. It's good. Looks like some of the bait's gone. So yeah, that's where I put it last night. I 
and that's the where the rabbits I think they go in and you've got the path there right let's see what we've got back home it's quite a bit of a breeze up now so I'm just doing a bit of a sound test see if you can hear me all right got the wind muffler on again which I'll be using every all the time now regardless of what the uh, the wind's like I've just uh, come to the far end of the field just before I approach the stream and I'm getting another scent so I'm probably going to mark this spot on the uh, wild game tracker definitely a scent around here can't see any obvious markings or scat but yeah I'm going to mark that Somebody's placed this bird box in the woods. And I just keep checking on that hole to see if it's uh, getting made any bigger by something. Probably a blue tit or something like that. Now that's interesting. That doesn't look like dog to me. Got worms in there. Probably sort of nipped off at the end there. Quite earthy. I wonder if that's badger. Such a beautiful morning. I thought I might as well carry on down the bridleway and uh, just see what things are like early in the morning. I can tell you one thing sun's right in my eyes <laughs> yeah it's beautiful lovely and fresh this is where I'd normally be standing oh duck this is where I'd normally be standing to uh, show you the sunset you can see it's totally different this morning because the sun is right behind me I'm looking forward to the arrival of the ladybirds down here when all these uh, plants grow up on either side of the bridleway this white stuff here which I'm not sure what it is um, is festooned with all different types of ladybird so I'm looking forward to that fortunately my zoom doesn't go any better than that you can see the gull on the right right in the middle there I think that's a lapwing. There are a lot of those around here, you can hear them really making a noise at night. It never ceases to amaze me how you can walk along all the way along there. It's just all green, 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 green. And you come to this one little spot. You got the whites and the blues. And even that one there. Looks like it's bluebells before they open up. Can you see what I can see? Can you spot it? Alfred's cake. It's 
So we're back in uh, morning mode now. Um, hopefully you will have seen some uh, footage from this evening's walk. So I hope you enjoyed that uh, slight variation. If you did, give us a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe by hitting the button up here or the one down there. And don't forget to click on that bell icon so you don't miss out on my next video. Right, I'm off back home, back to bed. Check the video footage. See you on the next one.